half, they did a better job of controlling the game. Uh, we struggled to put two, more than two passes together. Uh, we got a goal, which, you know, heads up work around the goal. And Kevin, Kevin had a great game today, a rookie, as did Josh. Uh, both of them had a great game. So at the half, you know, I basically said, and we're down, we're up one nothing, but that's not good because we haven't controlled the game. I thought when we come out the second half, we kind of took charge of the game. You know, we took advantage of our opportunities, and that was that was huge. A couple in front of that, I mean, we could actually should have had one, one or two more. But you know, we got the lead. They come back with one, but then we got that third one, which you know was the difference. And it kind of looked like it took the life out of them. They kind of sagged after we scored that third goal. So, no, I was pleased. Good effort today. Good effort. Um, they're a good team. We've, we've been playing well uh, the last three games. I mean, we lost the first game of the season, and we've gotten a, a tie in four wins. So we're playing good soccer right now. And probably our best player didn't play today. Guy, the blue shirt on. Sermon. Who's that? Who's that, Stan? No. 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 Sermon. Yeah. yeah. He's, 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 he's got a back injury. He's probably one of our top three or four players, without question. So everybody else picked it up today and played very well as a team today. And the second half especially, I thought we played much, much better than the first half. A couple of uh, big saves by the goalie in the first yes. half there, so yep. we'll just talk about his performance tonight as well. Troy's played well all season long. Defense has played well in front of him, but he's made some key saves when we've needed him. And he's done a good job all year. I mean, he's average giving up, I think it's like we gave up one today, so probably 1.3 goals against for the season, so he's, he's done. He hasn't given up more than two goals in the game. So the defense has played well in front of him. And he's a good communicator back there. He's talking to the team all the time. And that's huge, especially talking to the defense. No, it's pleased. I thought Kevin and Josh played super today really well. Uh, and we should play as a team, which we didn't do too well in the first half. I thought the second half, everything changed. We kind of controlled the game. And even getting up two when they come back with one, that two goal lead is the worst in the world, as they say. And they come back and got one, but we took the momentum away by getting the third goal. So, please, good effort. Uh, what's next? You got, who you guys playing? Danvers on Wednesday. And so, what is the mindset going forward? Just uh, keep it consistent? We want to be consistent. We want to move the ball. Danvers got a real good team. We play Wednesday, then we don't play for a week. So, it'd be nice to continue on here. Uh, and control the ball. We beat Danvers last year on senior night in Danvers. We beat them one nothing, and they had an undefeated season going. I mean, we get in the tournament, but they were the cream who played a super game last year. So I'm sure they're going to be looking for us on Wednesday night. No question. All right, thanks a lot. Okay. Stan, if there was uh, if there was one thing that you wanted to improve on the team, what what are you guys going to be working on in the days ahead here? We're going to work on better. Well, I would say inside the 18, getting shots off. We have a tendency to try to beat one against two, one against three, and we've got to lay the ball off. We've got to get more crossing balls for people to finish in front of the goal. That's what we need to do.